hasn't it? I'm alive. I'm recording this today after Synth Cat was released. Now it's gonna keep the video just unlisted, but I decided, you know what? Nah, why not? Let's send it to people. Ah, uh, yes, this predicament. The current plan is to go and beat up the wall of flesh. Yeah, I know this ain't gonna work. I did a little bit of off camera work to make sure that I could get everything ready. Namely, the gigantic bridge of doom. Way I'm thinking this works out. Uh, let's take some of those. Is the guy alive? I think so. Maybe not. Yeah, no, he's dead. That's unfortunate. But... Anyways. Magic power, mana regen, wrath, endurance, rage. And he's alive. Swiftness, iron skin, regen. Salt changer, calamity. Definitely gonna want the increased jump speed. That's that's very 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 important in this case. I'm buying everything because I'm going to need the everything. So here's the plan, we're gonna summon the wall of flesh, we're gonna die to it, we're gonna have the wall of flesh go all the way across. That way, we can go to the left without being absolutely besieged by mobs. What is it pointing at? I'm trying to figure out where the rare mob and all this is. I'm not seeing it. No rare creatures. Wait, so there was a copper coin bag? Seriously, you had me doing all this for a copper coin bag? I don't care. Well, that's annoying. Alright, now, if you're wondering, hey, why do you have your uh, balloons off? It's because I have a new plan of stupidity. Also, I figured out that once this squares out, you get the double jump. So, we already have two jumps along with Spectre Roots. And, you don't take fall damage if you fall on lava with the lava waders. So, we need to summon the waffle to get boss Zen. Yeah. So yeah, I'll show you a bit of the boss fight and how it goes. Use the zapper to get rid of all the hungry. Just the plan. Get eaten by said hungry instead. Now, most of them get stuck up there, which is nice. Anyway, once it's down to just you and the boss. Uh, oh yeah, you have to be close to him, otherwise he'll start going super sane, which is not what we want. Because yeah, if I were to like, go all the way out here, then he'd roar and he'd go super fast. And we don't want him going super fast. Him going super fast would be the bad. Okay, we're 
going to die, but we're in softcore and I don't have money on me anyways. Now that, that is the BS I don't understand. shooting red beams and those are super scary I think it's around when he gets to half health but yeah we were able to do half his health just walking away with no potions so I think we're gonna do pretty good can't say for certain though and one thing I want to do so that when I respawn, I don't have to go through all of this again. Because the plan is, I will probably die at least once. But the good news is, I will respawn at my bed, and I will be able to continue the fight. Now, if I was a smart man, I'd go all the way out to the jungle, dig all the way down to hell, and have my spawn point there. But hopefully, I don't have to do that, because that would be a lot longer and even more off-screen work. I despise off-camera work. Because, oh yay, look at me. I just got these stacks of diamond off-camera. I can't really live stream it and be like, eh, this is my completely chill stream. Because, one, no one knows my Twitch, though they could probably look it up and find it. Too, because I don't have a second monitor to actually interact with a Twitch chat if I had one. Which, spoiler alert, I do not. Uh. So yeah, no mobs because of boss zen, which is a nice thing added by Calamity. start taking damage, but, uh, we can prevent all that with a campfire. The damage comes from being over 50% mana and having this thingy. Oh yeah, and we want to leave these here. That's another benefit of fighting the boss early. I built all of this and made sure most of this was lava so I could fall on it without, you know, dying. I wish that this was lower down, but I'll live.
grab a life force potion? I don't think I did. Dang it. Ladies and gents, that's the wall of flesh spawner. Now we gotta get close before we decide to just watch the yellow part of all of us. gonna have to check the time on the episode. I didn't think that would actually work. I died. We were at the end of the bridge. It was perfect. Wait, I need to get the pwn hammer and all the drops. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold. Okay. Timer is freaking started. And if I don't get that pwn hammer, I am dead. Like, deader than dead dead. Like, I will be the dead, the deadest person to ever live. Okay, this seems cool. Hi, Corruption, directly at where I spawned. How are you doing? Great. When I say we were at the end of the bridge, I meant we were at the end of the frickin' bridge. We had, like... Not far. Is this a tax man or something down here? Yep, tax man. Didn't buy any uh, purified powder though. Where did the wall of flesh die? Why is his stuff not here? Did I pass it? No, really, uh, 
Okay, so it says my last death is back here. Right? Yeah, it says I died right there. Okay. When I said we ran out of bridge, we, we, we ran, ran, ran out of bridge. Not like, oh yeah, the bridge ended. It was like, okay, 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 okay. I did not realize that like this had ended. Bringer mimic. I just want what I am rightfully owed. Well, if you could kindly not. game crashes and all of reality implodes so get out the way me amigos <sighs> I know I am breathing a lot it's not good it makes the video sound terrible I know this and I deeply apologize for it but if I don't breathe, then I'm going to asphyxiate and die. And that would be bad. Because if I die, no one will get this wall of flesh loot. And if that happens, this entire Terraria world was a waste. I can't even pass it on to my non-existent freaking next generation. Favorite this item gain increased item grab range. Why not? Hermit's box of 100 medicines. Summons the third sage. Use this item with the right click in the hot bar to trigger the third sage's blessing. The blessing will spawn with full health rather than half. Exactly say. Sunken sea trembles. Wall of flesh has been defeated. New life springs from the aquatic depths. I got some tokens, and the wall of flesh has killed every player. First, hard mode post skeleton. seen anything specific here except for the celestial magnet cross necklace hyperventilation intensifies and tokens the next accessory reforge would be this so you can guarantee what your next Accessory will give you that. What can I do with the dimensional casket? Uh, the guide is dead, so. Can we 
used to make Heart of Greed with a gold ring and hollowed bars and divine lava. Or to make an actual one with any tier 3 hard mode bar. Interesting. Let's see what all these dudes with exclamation points have to say. Hellfire arrows and explosive powder. Okay. They used to make rockets, exploding bullets, and the impaler. With scoria bars and a steak launcher, and I, I could do with a steak. You have the conductor stand, which increases empowerment stuff, so basically, like, okay. Your instruments cost no inspiration, deal no damage, and cannot be mistimed. So that's literally just for buffing allies. This is another thing for allies. I already bought the yarn ball off ya. Why? I asked the paintball gun, which is actually really good. Steampunker has awoken. What the hell do you mean? I haven't beaten a mechanical boss yet. If the steampunker is here, we have some serious, serious, serious problems, Dr. Houston. The steampunker is here before I've killed a mechanical boss. This is not good. <sighs> I say it's not good because he's gonna give us access to a ton of stuff that we should not have yet. Like the jetpack and the clintaminator and the static hook and literally everything else. You know what? Why not? Let's try it. Can he hurt? This is ranged damage, but it and it's slow speed, but it is 41 frickin' damage. And tries to electrocute a bunch of people. But requires steam batteries to work. Uh, maybe, maybe I'll buy stuff from you later. For now. I have other jargon. Like this Medusa head. Sick cane steals a money. Uh, nice. Okay, gunman. What do the guns say? Boomstick, tungsten bullets, empty bullets, sot gun. That's pretty dang cool. So, the thing from the stars did land. That's not good. That's not good at all. Dirt pouch is still pretty good. I don't think he changed what he sells, but maybe. Clothier, you can now buy golden keys. And the trash set. Yay. Party girl, party girl. Benign balloon and concert tickets. Alright. Let's open this treasure bag, eh? It's taken long enough. 
And there goes my inventory. Deadly meow thrower. <sighs> Flimsy blast barrel. Clockwork Assault Rifle. Demon Heart. Yay. Ranger Emblem. Uh, Demon Trophy. Why not? Cleric Emblem. Rogue Emblem. Pone Hammer. All of these are heckin' materials for other junk and jargon. Where'd my guide go? Is he still not back? Still not back. I'll do it myself. Can I use to make elemental eruption with you know galactic singularities, as you do. the blast barrel oh that's not that difficult to make I don't think doesn't look terrible oh yay traveling merchant you might actually have really good stuff now uh, I already have that Wow, I'm disappointed in you. I truly am. Uh, that goes in blocks, and then a bunch of stuff goes in magic. By a bunch of stuff, I mainly mean that. Is there even there? It seems to be. I can use the boss swap token on the ranger emblem. <sighs> yeah, you can boss swap it. Or you can combine it with, you know, Celestial Stones, Core of Calamity, and Plurda Plurda Plur. You know, like you do. Uh, so if I really wanted to, I could switch it out at any time. Hello, random flying snake. How are you doing? He doesn't even take up a buff. That's nice. Now then, the charm of luck. Yeah, no, that's not happening anytime soon. The alchemist charm. To upgrade that to the next tier, we need hard mode bars and hard mode components. Alright. Anyways. Let me test. Around 150. DPS. Uh, 
around 260 DPS. So yeah, that's better. And comparing this, well. Yeah, no. And you're not used in crafting, so goodbye. The way I tend to like this setup is to have that there, and then whatever barred weapon I happen to be using, which is none because it turns out they're not all that good. That there, that there, and that there. Anyways, we don't need this just sitting in our inventory the whole dang time. Yeah, I'll use the Kylie. I will say, the Lion Fist frickin' saved us there at the end. <sighs> Alright. Now. Time to clean out this! <laughs> because it's so fun getting into hard mode and then immediately deciding to clear your inventory. Good news though, I'm about to expand this so that there's less junk, you know. Just chuck that in there at this point. Hey, I don't think anyone cares about uh, 600, that's fine. Seed rain staff. Yeah, yeah, that needs to hang around. I know, I know. Gaster man. Yeah, yeah. Didn't I buy the two minion slot thingy from you? Also, do I have two minion slots? I do. I don't know why, but I do. I don't know if it's better, but it looks cool. They deal the same damage, except I can have four of these and one of these. It better be a fast attacking gun drone. Is to permanently upgrade your nurse. Opens up healing interface after respawn. This effect is global for all players in this world, but only work if nurse is alive. Yay! That costs 44 mana, though. Huh. That seems like it would be good. Friendship ended with restoration potions. Life water. Alright. Alright, alright. Who wants to go on a house building spree? Cause uh, all rooms are full. That's why the guide hasn't come back. The freaking only area he could spawn in has been corruptified. All right, all right. I'll make it quick. Might be a bit better than the herrings. Maybe. Maybe just a little bit. I wanted to have my, like, second building area be out here, but apparently that's not an option. 
So fine. Out here it is. Where's my granite? M marble, marble. 117, that's more than enough. And granite. Uh, 611, that's enough. This one doesn't actually count as a room, right? Because it's too small by one. I believe so, anyways. Yeah. Alright, fine. Get out the way. Oh, huh, that's interesting. Gotta make sure that we go even one over that. Absolutely no one will notice the fact that the chairs are all the same. Yep, no one will notice that. Where's my feller of evergreens? That's better than the herrings could do. Let's look at that DPS. 40? That knockback is good. Hi, random thingy mabopper that I'm now going to have to put somewhere. Chest detected. Burb. Could you not? I'm 
busy. So inconsiderate. Wizard to move in, the Steampunker to move in, the Guide to move in. That's just three of them. And there's probably even more blackguards who show up because hard mode. I swear, if the trash man shows up. Yay. Alright, this went a lot faster than the previous floor. That's nice. So that's what, 10 or 20 minutes of just building random garbage. Yay, I'm sure everyone loved watching that. My timer has been lying to me. My apologies. We don't have a lot of time left and I'm spending it just building garbage. We are at least, at least, to make it to the corruption and break some altars. I guarantee you that. And then probably a mining episode where I get all the cobalt, mithril, and blurg. Like you do. Oh, that's why. Quick stacked. Smooth that, smooth that, obsidian brick. Uh, platforms. Yep, need those. Anyways, I have enough rooms, maybe. Uh, with this, you never know how many rooms you're gonna actually heck need. But one thing I can say is that we're going to need more storage space. And for that, Bloom, you don't really do much now, do you? Yeah, 
Yep, I'm creating the storage network of doom. And Wizlord has arrived. Hello, Mr. Wizlord. You can buy time forwardisms. Yay. This, I think, summons Blood Moon. Successfully timing hits. No. Oh, and you can buy magic missile from him, eh? What the heck is this? Clearly is equipped somewhere. It better not be down here. It is. What the heck? So I got one dude to fight, one dude to light the way, and one dude who literally just follows you around. Really, that's how this goes. I appreciate the effort, but I kind of have to... The brewer is here. He when did you even get here? Ah, you just showed up. Combinations. Buying one of these gets you swiftness, endurance, life force, iron skin, obsidian skin, thorns, and regen. And with mods, all of the above, plus titan skin. And in invin invincibility? Eh. And he has these for like every class. And they all last for 14 minutes. Instead of one lasting for and another lasting for plan. They all last for 14 minutes. This dude is God. You can also buy the uh, witch doctor flasks, which is nice. Guide has re arrived. Yay. Nah, nah, nah. That's not where you go. That's not where you go either. Why? Why do you do this to me? Let's get to work. Guide. Where the heck is he? He's somewhere around here. One of these. Ah, there. For some reason he spawned up here. Ah, yes. You know, the space helmet. Of course. Who could forget the space helmet? I couldn't. I couldn't forget what it was because I had no idea what it was. Is accessories too full? Not yet. Damn, that is a lot of suit spikes. They're only used to make the tiger climbing gear. We can buy the tiger climbing gear. Ergo, get out. Also, I still have all of these random meteorite things. Which, we still have no clue how to break. Well, I don't. What, do I need to frickin' whack it with the pwn hammer? Uh. It's not 
game will break shit now. I don't think it's the hard mode blacksmith. No. Is it the operator? No. Is it the stupid arena guy? No. Is it this dude? No. I have no clue. Hey, we can just buy the crystal ball now. 15 gold from you. 10 gold from you. Deal to deal. And now we can make the infinite arrows. Yay, but we need a bunch. No. Ah, yes, this goes in hell. Back, not exactly the way I found them. How oh, evil. Ah, oh, yes. The weird glitchy boss log. Yeah, that's how many times it took me off camera to build the bridge. A, a lot. Lowest health state, zero out of zero. Ha, ha, ha. This is the breaker blade. There's the laser rifle. There's the different emblems. There's the Black Hawk remote. The Corruption Key and the Crimson Key. Because technically he's one of those. Anyways. Why does this not go in here? Alright, well. Wait a second. Dang it, I said something stupid, and now I'm gonna have to go and make good on my word. <sighs> I only have five minutes. Oh dear. But I said I'd go and I'd break the stupid thing, so I'm gonna go and break the stupid thing. Ah uh, yes, my map got reset, so I don't know which one of these is the right one. Terrible tragedy. Great, we found it. Anyways, yeah, now these dudes are gonna sew up because I broke one of their special things. Generally, you just ignore them until they become too big of a threat to ignore, and then they kill you. That's how it tends to go, anyways. Oh, fast clock. Thank you. Corruption tokens, corruption tokens. In the world with tons of garbage. You guys can't overwhelm me if you just stay down there in a hole. Sunbat down here, in the middle of heckin' nowhere. Mind giving me a single cursed flame? Mm. No. Appreciate the warning there, buddy. I don't know what button I just pushed there, but it wasn't nine. Oh, that's a glow stick, not an altar. Good.
Ah, now they, they swarm me and I die hard. guys up as absolute murderers who are going to rend my me limb from limb but you couldn't even get a single arm off poor sewing lads poor sewing now my inventory is full of your garbage that's just disrespectful Wraith Banner. Blindfold as well? You're spoiling me with the Yonk pieces. Ton of money from all these clocks because they're right twice a day. I'm going a little bit over time, specifically because I said the stupid words. You know, I'm going to go ahead and do this. No. And then I started, you know, building random garbage. Which means this episode is going a little long, but hopefully that's right. I mean, next episode's going to be super boring and probably going to have to be two times speeded by you guys because I still don't know how to edit and it's going to be just me mining. Gotta get these ores somehow.
Disruption Effigy. Player's has their movement speed increased and crit chance increased and lower damage. Is that a trade I'm willing to make? I don't know. Mimic! Why do you have 7,000 health? If he comes zooming over here, I swear. Salt, they will be. Alright, but we're going to have to find out what all this junk does in the next episode. I will see you guys then. Apologies again for this going over long. See you guys.